in clinical medicine it is sometimes necessary to know how many liters of blood a person has in order to calculate the allowable blood loss during surgery and so on you must have imagined that a child will have much less blood compared to an adult weighing 80 kilos so in order to calculate how many milliliters of blood a person exactly has you have to multiply a fixed number with the child's or a man's body weight and according to whether they are male or female the fixed number for a female adult is 65 and for adult male it is 75 and for a full-term neonate it is 85 and for a premature neonate it is 95 you must observe here that the increment of numbers is 10 65 75 85 95 starting from the bottom that is adult female going up adult male and then full-term neonate and then premature there is one exception to the rule but i will show that in the last so if we take an example of a 30 year old male weighing 70 kilograms so uh, the person in question is of course an adult and a male subject so we have to choose a fixed number of 75 and then we multiply that with 70 that is the weight of the person and we arrived at 5 to 5 zero ml of blood so the take-home message or the key learning point here is that we have to remember numbers 65 75 85 and 95 however in case of infants we have to multiply their body weight by 80 that 80 falls in between and is in violation of the increment by 10 anyway it is it must not be difficult to remember